for dedicated students of comedy. My guests tonight certainly offer a class you don't want to miss. Their Emmy-nominated HBO series, Mr. Show. Please welcome, did somebody actually write the professors of yucks on this thing? <laughs> <laughs> I can't call them that. They're too hip for that. Bob Odenkirk and David Cross, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> David, thank you, sir. Thank you. Bobby. Oh, wow. Boys. Oh, my God. Look at this. How really you boys came. doing? We're, we're yeah. obviously moving up because yeah. we both have a place to sit on the yeah. Dennis Miller Live show. No, I don't remember that. Last time you were here, we only had one chair. David yeah. sat in my lap. Yeah. Well, the show was new. I didn't know if you were <laughs> shitheads or cool at that point. <laughs> well. You we know what it costs to rent a new chair? No. Like 400 bucks. That's how crazy the world is. You go out, you rent an extra chair, 400 bucks. It's and I like you. In. But around $398 worth. <laughs> now, um, what, uh, what, what colleges did you guys, I don't know your college history. I know, Bobby, I used to work with you at Saturday Night Live. Right, but I'm not a Harvard guy. No, you weren't? No, How no. many of the guys were there? There were oh, heavy everybody, Harvard, though, everybody right? Everybody except for me. I went to Southern Illinois University. Ah, the Salukis, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> yes. Wow, you know more about it than I do. <laughs> I remember they won the NIT one year, didn't they? I, what ago? is that? Huh? Is that, is that a real? drinking contest? <laughs> <laughs> is that? <laughs> National Invitational. Yeah, I just like being in a place where I was, you know, the smartest guy and most <laughs> industrious. So I, I actually, you know, I actually went to four colleges because so? I went to college when I was 16. I went to uh, college. No, are yeah. you one of those brainiacs? Did well, I was a up? brainiac, but then I was like, but I don't want to compete with other brainiacs. So uh, I went to uh, College of DuPage near my house. DuPage? I, yeah, because I was such a young guy. I thought I'll never make it at college because I'm only 16. And then the next year I went to Marquette. DuPage, when, I, I know. What is that? Is that down near University of uh, RuPaul? It's, or? <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it's just like a school for housewives. And then and, the second one? <laughs> and, um, well, there's a crowd pleaser, huh? And, uh, Got an email, they can send it directly to you. <laughs> uh, DuPage, then what was then the second Marquette. one? Marquette. Marquette, okay. And then, you know, when I finally went away to college, I was like, God, everybody acts like they're three. I can handle this, so... Then I chose a college that I could just be the smartest, most industrious guy at, which was Southern Illinois University. And I kicked ass there. It was great. Uh, so that's were you an outcast because you were the brightest, or uh, were you welcomed no, into the... No, 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 no. No, they, uh, everybody there was kind of an outcast, so they all, they all hung together. It was really but, cool. You, there's also a, a degree of how smart the people are. I mean, it, it's... I, I mean, I don't want to take anything away oh, from you, please. but when people are going, coming up to you going, Yada smarty! <laughs> it doesn't have the same thing. Dave, you got a name for that little character you just did there? Who is that? Uh, that's quirky. <laughs> Dave Give us a little, more, why, a little more quirky. Give me a little quirky. I, I don't feel so good. <laughs> I, it's, I, come on, Dennis. I'll work on it on the way home. But, oh, you know, quirky's don't... beautiful. There's a lot of layers yeah, there. there. Is. I like quirky. Yeah. Where'd you go to college now, Quirk? Uh, I, I went to Emerson College in Boston. Every comedian! Now, give me the lineage of the comedians who have gone there. It's, it's crazy. It's, and it, it, has no, it has nothing to do with the school. I don't know why, because the school is not very good. <laughs> right? Yeah. Um, don't, don't waste your money and go there. Just, uh... But it is the Tigris and Euphrates of American stand-up comedy. Who's, and, who went there? Leno? Uh, Jay Leno, Dennis Leary, Stephen Wright, Laura Keitlinger, uh... Um, you, me, you. Uh, Don Rickles. Did Janine go? Don Rickles. No, Janine didn't. <laughs> uh, <laughs> George Bernard Shaw went there. Uh, he had he did stand up for a couple years. I saw him. <laughs> yeah, I saw him kill at the Improv one night. It's, just... it's I mean, it's very strange, but it's uh, it's not a. It has nothing to do with comedy. No. That's cool. Well, what, 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 now, what is your flash? We'll go with you first, Dave. What is your flash memory of Emerson? What particular college memories do you have? And was the overview traumatic, or did you enjoy your college experience? Um, I did enjoy it, I, but it was on a totally about how I developed socially. It had nothing to do with uh, the education I was getting or lack of education I was When you went to Emerson, were you a complete recluse, or were you a cool kid, or where were you? What were you? Uh, I wasn't cool. I, I wasn't cool. I was, uh, I was like... I was a huge smartass, and I loved having this new playground to be a smartass, you know? Because <laughs> um, in high school, you can get kicked out, and it, 
it, you know, there are ramifications at home. But in college, like, whatever, man, fuck it, man. I'm getting high and, you know, and, and it was great. It's the first time I started experimenting with drugs and, uh, and uh, no, and I learned how to, to use them properly. And, uh, cause kids today, in high school, you don't know. You fuck it up in high school. But in college, that's where you figure out, oh, that's what I need to do. Now, when you got to Emerson, and I hate to be indelicate here, possibly, because this, you can factor this in to your general memory of your college experience. You arrive in Emerson. Are you bald? <laughs> <laughs> or if that's what something was... everybody is doing... <laughs> And so you shaved your head, right? That's right. And then it never grew back. <laughs> what the hell? No, I was, uh, I was balder, actually. And this is all that from the can. The can thing wasn't invented when I... And then a couple years ago, Ronco came out with a thing. And now, like, look at me. I don't want to use it. I'm kind of cheap, so I don't use it at all. Plus, I think the monk thing is going to... You just have the spray-on sideburn yeah. thing. Yeah. The spray-on... Uh, mutton yeah, chop right, adapter right, right. kit. I, I was, love that. I actually, I started balding uh, pretty early. <laughs> I did. But you um, already were bald in college? Not bald, like, ha ha, that's funny bald. But, <laughs> uh, <laughs> but I was, uh, I was losing my like, hair. Like, ha ha, you're so talented, bald. <laughs> <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> you're killing. Uh, uh, what about you now, Bobby? What's your general oh memory man. of Southern Illinois? I gotta Kong? say, it was mushrooms. It was doing mushrooms. No. I know. No, come look. On, no, you shouldn't on. abuse drugs, but Dennis, I, when I think about that time, I... Well, first, I worked really hard and I wrote comedy. That's what I did with my free time because I didn't have to study at all. I don't want to hear the mushroom story. I, I'm sorry. I just right, got to stop that in the I, I want you to tell me. I understand. I just, um, you know... I guess I, it was the craziest thing that happened to me there. So I do remember that but but you but actually, actually I used college. portobello mushrooms yes of course okay and my goodness what other kind <laughs> out there um i i used college as a place to uh to do comedy to write comedy and uh so i wasted all that money i guess i could have just done it at home and about the same number of people would have seen me do it and uh <laughs> But uh, I feel like it was a good experience. It was a good leaping off point. You know, I always thought was I was in a holding college. pattern until I vaguely got it together. And yeah, it's also right. about, uh, yeah. like dating, yeah. you know? It's the, college was the first time that I, I had sex on a regular basis. You know, it wasn't some fluky thing that, uh, you know, or, or like a, a high school girlfriend that you have to uh, go out with until you have sex and realize, I'm only going out to have sex, you know? But you actually like, you know what I mean? And, and socially... Boy. Well, I know if there's one area where the baldness helps, it's the dating thing. Oh, yeah. man, you, you joke, but... Married bald guys get the most. <laughs> <laughs> All right, line three. I'm going, too. I'm going to be joining you soon. All right, well, going, I'm starting to get that... You know uh, about the secret oh. club. Huh? Up in, uh... Starting to look like a <laughs> mentalist. <laughs> Hide my check anywhere. If I don't find it, I don't get paid. <laughs> Line three, we've got Thomas from Grove City, Ohio. Tom, what's your question? Um, Big college in Grove City, isn't there? Is there? No. Okay. <laughs> is there a city there? If you guys were 18, just graduated from high school, yeah. and you can go to any college or university in the U.S., where would you go? I always thought that I'd go to the College of Cardinals because I'd look the most limber. <laughs> You'd get on the basketball team. Uh, where would I go? I, well, you know what? If you have no idea where you would go, don't spend a lot of money. Yeah. Um, if, you, if that's your question, go to a state school uh, and go hang out there for a weekend and check them all out. And if you have a good time, that's where you should go. Or go to Hawaii. Find some bullshit school in Hawaii. <laughs> Four years in Hawaii. <laughs> Down there. At I the... have to go to Hawaii. <laughs> right? It's where I go to school. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to be in there getting a medical examination and look up and see that his degree is from like Don Ho <laughs> University or something. You know? <laughs> What's wrong with me, right. Doc? I've got my bladder in tiny bubbles. All right, now did you uh, did you graduate from college? Did yeah, I eventually out? did. I, I went to uh, final. Took one last class in Chicago and I got my degree. 
Yeah? Yeah, well, I felt like I owed it to my mom because she paid for the whole damn thing. All right. So, Bobby, a touching uh, softer nice, side that I don't sweet. see on Mr. Show. Uh, Davey, did you I, graduate? I dropped out because my mom didn't pay for the whole thing. <laughs> and, uh, you know, and... You had to show her that was wrong. Right. <laughs> now, where's right. your show at? Are you in hiatus? Are you on right We're now? We're right writing a movie. Feature. Oh. A Mr. Show feature. Tell me, tell me. It's called Ronnie Dobbs, and it's about a character who uh, gets famous from being arrested on cops. I always feel Sounds so good. sorry for that bastard. Man. <laughs> in his undies face right. down in that safe right. on parking lot. It's kind of... <laughs> it's the look he always He's got the yeah. heel pressed on his face. It's a, it's a grim place to yeah. go from. Boys, always good to Thanks, see you. Bob Thanks, and David, man. ladies and gentlemen. Thanks. Stick around. We're good to do it. Thanks,